hospital mistakes and how to avoid them. A new study shows most parents feel they need to be vigilant when their child is in the hospital to make sure the hospital doesn't make mistakes. Senior medical correspondent Elizabeth Cohen is here now to explain. Good morning to you, Good Elizabeth. Morning. So, I thought hospitals, you know, were supposed to make you feel better, but I think a lot of us have seen, you know, quite a few of these reports that come out about errors that uh, that definitely take place. So when you're a parent of a child, your child is ill. I mean, I feel like people are, are really wanting to know more and, and be very focused on the care that their kids are getting. Yes, this survey said that people get it. Two thirds of parents said that they get it, that they need to be vigilant when their child is in the hospital to make sure that the hospital doesn't make some kind of an error that could make their child sick. And you know what? They're doing it with reason. Studies have shown that one out of 15 children who's in the hospital, <coughs> excuse me, is harmed by a medication error. That's one out of 15 kids. That's a pretty high rate. And for all of us, take a look at these statistics. There are up to 98,000 deaths in hospitals due to errors. Not, not because you're sick, but due to an error that made you sicker. And also 99,000 deaths from infections that people get in the hospital. In other words, Heidi, they come into the hospital without an infection. They get the infection in the hospital. Yeah, well, and that number from the Institute